Popularly known for his role as a brandier in YOLO, Ivan Adomo is a budding actor, model and entrepreneur. You know, I'll just have the same thing. Any drink? Some fruit juice would be fine. You said something strong for you. Water. Are you sure? Cold water. He has featured in several commercials and models for his online clothing retail outlet, Atadapa. Okay, so hi, my name is Ivan Iduma. I play the role of a brand here in YOLO, and I'm here to answer 50 questions with the PAVE Network. So, you know, let's get right to it, right? This is 50 Questions on the PAVE Network, a show where your favorite personalities answer the curious and risky questions sent by you. Let's head over to the PAVE Studios for the guest of the day. Um, so someone's asking, apart from acting, what else do you do? Um, quite a number of things. So I do a little bit of real estate. Um, I service people coming from the diaspora who are coming in for short, medium to long term. I get them apartments, take them on tours, do those things. That's my company called Living Ghana. That's number one. Number two, I own a delivery service called the Blue Shake Delivery Service. Number three, I own a clothing retail store and brand called Atadipa. So I'm even on Atadipa shirt right now, all right? And eh. yeah, and sometimes I do marketing strategy for social media, basically. Please, are you dating? I'm sorry, I'm not dating, but I'm not available, please. Don't try it. Thank you very much. Okay, good. Do you have a tattoo? No, unfortunately, I do not. But I hope to have one real soon, though. I want to have one across here. But I have to go to the gym first, so that, you know, when you see, then it is nice. See, <laughs> the god of a fool. Um, <laughs> somebody ask how much girls you get. Like, bruh, like, don't you think about money? To come home. Like, anyway, um, let's go to the next one. How old are you? I'm in my mid 20s, my upper mid 20s. Okay, I'm growing old. Um, which school did you complete? Um, if I'm going to start from the beginning, I went to learning skills, I did Morning Star, I did a Kosumu International School, and I did the University of Ghana Ligan. Main campus, please. Um, how did you get yourself casted in YOLO? Well, I was called for an audition and then I went and by the grace of the Lord God Almighty, I got it. Yeah, that's just for dramatic effect, don't mind me. Okay. <clears throat> what are some of the challenges you face as an actor? Um, I think, I think the greatest challenge is the immediate deprivation of privacy. You can't go anywhere and go and hide. Like sometimes it's very nice. So you guys should really understand when people um, are very particular about when they are in some place, they're in their comfort zone and you approach them too much. Like sometimes you just need some, you just need some space, I beg you. So that's, that's the biggest challenge. Um, uh, someone is asking, do you love Pearl behind the camera? Oh, um, no. I love her with the love of the Lord. I love her with the love. I can see the glory of the Lord. I love her with the love of the Lord. Just as Christ loved us. So please, for the sake of this, interview every time i wear my shades i go into pasta mode because i'm a cool pasta okay i don't i know i'm not a them i'm a dope pasta you know i call blooming someone asked uh if you were offered the position of president of ghana today would you take the job or not and why i wouldn't take it because i don't think i'm prepared for that kind of pressure one i don't think i have the the know-how to run a, a whole country my house if it be matter <laughs> um, but nah, actually, I won't take it. I mean, they solve them too much. I need peace. 
any peace. It's okay. Like, see how my hammer is suffering. Anyway, so, um, somebody's asking, please, are you dating? No. I am in a deep relationship with the Lord God Almighty. Now and forever. Amen. Is the is the pink lips natural? Yes. No, I just eat a lot of pepper. I eat pepper. <laughs> I eat pepper. When I grind my pepper, I don't put in toast inside. You understand? When I grind my pepper, I don't put in toast. Pure pepper, onion, salt, so you get some. This is not hard. Try it. Okay, and then when you, you let the pepper stay in your mouth small, it go burn and well. Which of your mistakes would you never repeat if you are given a second chance? See, this is a story, but unfortunately, this story I honestly cannot tell it on camera. Okay, but maybe sometime, like when I'm drunk or something, with the wine of the Holy Spirit. Do you have a girlfriend? No, hopefully soon. But the thing that it is is that I am not available. Please, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Um, so, what was the best decision you ever made for yourself when everyone was doubting you? Hey, oh, this is a very nice question. Unfortunately, it took me by surprise. Um, this was a very personal this thing. But then, it did get to a point that I had to take a stand for myself and then step off a seemingly advantageous position to apply my own path and I think no one ever, especially the people who had me in that position, didn't believe that I could ever step off but then I did and by the glory of the Lord, it's working out, yeah, I mean sorry, by the glory of the Lord, it's working out for my good, thank you. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so someone is asking, so funny enough, the person asking why they need six lashes, <laughs> his handle is nine lashes. <laughs> So he says, why the name six lashes? I get this question a lot. So if you both, let me just address this one time and one time only. It was a childhood mistake. Okay. I changed my handle to six lashes because before, I mean, like, I'm shy to say this, but before six lashes, my handle was Ivan underscore Apple. Now, let me tell you why it was Ivan underscore Apple. Because you see, this is what iPhone. So me, I said I'm Ivan. So it's like Ivan by Apple. And I said no. As the John I was before, I said no. And as the John I was during the time that I did it too, I said, let me make it six lashes because at that point in time, when people are fooling, because a lot of my friends are fools, I said, you are going lash you, I'm go give you six lashes. And I said, oh, let me just do it because I thought it was funny. But then it became too late to change it because it got stuck. So that is the sad story of how it's six lashes. So please, it's six lashes. It's not six lashes, I beg you. Thank you. Because people do see that a lot. Why six lashes? Why do you sell? I, I don't. I don't. Um, so nine lashes also came to say, I got inspired by yours, so I had to make mine nine. Congratulations. <laughs> You've done well for yourself and for your family members. That good. Lord, I feel like half my color. Um, what is my house location? I didn't The only I can see it because you can go and search. See if you find me. Um, what turns you off about a girl? Um, the one main thing, I'm not body shaming. It's my personal preference. It doesn't have to have anything to do with you and how you see yourself. But me, Ivan, Nana Kwame Duma, I don't like big stomach. That is, that is all. And then I don't like those people who, how, how did they talk that in? Those people, some like people who always have an attitude now, gee. Because I, I think I'm a very free person. I'm guy guy. So you have to be a very open-minded person. But I love smart people down there, definitely. But big stomach, yeah, I beg you, I'm sorry. 
I heard George's mom in YOLO is your biological mom. How true is that, please? Unfortunately, hey, no, please. No, please, I beg. Leave that woman alone. <laughs> Let her have peace. I beg you. Um, how do you see life? What are your aspirations of life? Um, how do I see life? For I think we are all lucky to be here. I mean, um, I, I looked at this crazy fact that says um, the chances of you being born is like 400 trillion, one to 400 trillion. So for one thing, I mean, although life is a struggle, we are all here suffering and everything. But then one thing you should know that you're lucky to be here and you should make the best of it no matter what. Chase your happiness and do what, like do things that make you happy that are productive, okay? Please, the productivity part is very, very important because a lot of foolish things make us happy, but do things that make you happy, that are productive. That's the best way I think you can make the best out of the life that you're given, which you're really, really lucky to have. I mean, like you have more chances of being the richest man on earth than being born, for real. So, you can Google it. And I told you, okay, never lied. Um, so, who is your role model? Um, for one, I really love this guy called Gary V. Gary Vaynerchuk. I really love his outlook on life. His handle is Gary V. You can check him out. He is such a dope guy. And there's this guy called David Meltzer. He also has an amazing outlook on life. And they inspire me to see things in a much, much better way, to be honest. Mm. So yeah, uh, okay. Do you like any, oh, you people and girls, why? Anyway, do you like any of the girls you act with in YOLO? If yes, please give us a hint or say it straight up. Like I said before, I'm a very serious person, okay? I don't mix business with pleasure. On set, I'm a strict professional in the capacity that I can be, and then I don't do anything outside that. Thank you very much. Who is the best rapper in the USA for you? Um, honestly, I love Toby Nwigwe. You should check him out. He's very, very dope. I love him. With the love of the Lord. Please. Are you that anti so? No, unfortunately, I'm very, very social, okay? But I just like my space. That's the thing. So I go out when I have to, but I don't like going out too much, too. That's, that's the honest truth. <laughs> anyway, it's been fun with you guys. Um, Thank you for hopping on. This has been 50 Questions with Ivan. I hope you had as much fun watching this as I had making this. Uh, I like fooling the looks. I'm sorry. It is just my character. I'm not even funny. But then, um, obviously, thank you for, thank you for watching. Um, don't forget, never forget. You're watching this on YouTube right now. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So, Pave Network on YouTube. Pave Ghana on all other social media networks. And please take your prayer life seriously. Read the word of the Lord. Always choose to be the best person in the room. Okay? And always give out the best of you to the world. And God will surely, surely repay you in the best ways possible.